Welcome! And since I'm actually talking about a channel that did not block me whatsoever, that means I can literally insult this goneful fan base by defending someone that shot fireworks in his own room twice. So if you don't know or somehow forget based on what this fan base is claiming, yeah, this fan base is literally claiming you somehow forgotten he showed his private parts and gone away with it. And being ungrateful that he's being called a nickname now. Yeah, I'm not joking. This guy is literally being ungrateful. Being goddamn lucky he's not even demonetized at terminated over the multiple mistakes he did. Now, I know some people won't admit this, but I used to be a fan of I Show Speed. I really got him enjoyed him having a mental breakdown over mobile games or video games. It's when he started shooting fireworks in his own room, it's when I started to not like him. Like, really? Are you this stupid? And especially the people defending him right now. Like, he showed his private part. Why are you trying to justify it? By going on about mental health, like, oh my god, he's a human being. Humans make mistakes. Not ridiculously dumb mistakes like that. Why do you literally want to defend someone being ungrateful for getting a new nickname? His own channel name is a nickname. My channel name is a nickname. Literally, no one's offended with nicknames. Why are you crying over this? Let's read the comments and find out. The internet will remember, but the internet won't care. The next big thing will grab their attention. No, it doesn't whatsoever. That's the algorithm that is completely random that's showing what's trending in social media. The only people interested in the next big thing on social media are people that are desperate for money, desperate to get views, and desperate to grow the subscriber count massively. That is the only goddamn reason. It's a business decision, not something people will actually enjoy doing. Because what's so goddamn enjoyable talking about a stick figure in Roblox? Yes, I'm not joking. This is the next biggest goddamn thing about this game. And I'll still keep going on about how god awful it is. Legit, that is how boring and unfun Roblox is. Where the next big thing is a goddamn UGC cosmetic stick figure. They let it pass because the no hit was an accident, silly. No, YouTube let him pass because Speed deleted the live stream. That is literally the only goddamn reason they're not punishing him. Because Speed has been overdramatic multiple times in multiple video games for years and now decided to do that. That does not sound like an accident to me. That was intentional. Because explain any other person that has a mental breakdown on video games ever decide to show their private parts. None. None whatsoever except I show Speed. It is clearly not an accident. You're gonna be insanely going I'm stupid to do this accident and speed is not that dumb. You act like shooting fireworks in this room is a war crime. What is he even on about? It's not even a war crime. It's just illegal based on a quick Google search right there. He doesn't have a license at all. The only reason why he's not punished on this whatsoever is because the state he's living in, for some reason, using fireworks is not illegal for some reason. Fireworks AMP did it with much worse fireworks. So he's trying to compare someone else, you know, trying to justify that, oh, what Speed did isn't that bad, come on. It does not change the goddamn fact Speed shot it in his own room and put his family in goddamn danger. Or if Speed didn't do that, he screwed over his family economically because he got to repair some holes now. And all they got was some holes, Speed is a human. Have you heard of YouTube TOS? Essentially, if you want to do YouTube, you want to have a career with it, you want to stay monetized, you're going for its TOS. Otherwise, you get punished. YouTube doesn't care you're a human being, they expect you to follow the rules. And people watch him do the same thing for years. What do you mean Speed does the same goddamn thing? He shot fireworks in his own room, promoted a scam, literally showed his private parts. Do I need to go on? But I wouldn't be harassing him to the point where his mental health starts deteriorating. It's his fans. Then why the hell did I reply to you? Because I'm not targeting Speed, I'm targeting his goneful fan base that is defending and trying to justify this. Also, fix your grammar looks like a 10 year old wrote it. That does not matter when you're defending someone that shot fireworks in his own goddamn room. I'm typing English to you, I am speaking English to you, you understand the language perfectly fine, grammar means nothing for this, absolutely nothing. Dude, YouTube said it's okay, that's because of Speed taking it down. If Speed did not bother doing that, they, he would have been demonetized or terminated. Because YouTube did respond to this and did admit what he did was wrong, and that they decided to use the accident excuse because they're too lazy to take him down. He just got really excited to the point where he didn't, didn't know what he was doing. He's had mental breakdowns in video games for years. There is no excuse how you can do this accident or mistake. 
He has years of experience doing this. You can't just type in he didn't know what he was doing when he clearly does. He's been doing this for goddamn years and earns money off of this. This is his entire career. But the, the, the ages ago, this is way different. Then that stop bringing up other events that already happened. So this guy claiming what Speed did one year ago or a couple of months ago is somehow ages ago. Like, I would not bring up this type of stuff if he bothered to change whatsoever. He doesn't change. Speed keeps apologizing. I'm putting apologizing quotation marks saying he's going to be better not make the same mistake again. And he's still doing the same mistake again by being too stupid. Because he's being constantly called nicknames, his channel is a nickname, you idiot. If he didn't want to be called nicknames in the goddamn internet, he should have showed his in real life name on YouTube instead of his goddamn nickname. And it's just making him feel really worse than he already is with the sickness. What sickness? Explain to me what sickness happens over saying nicknames. No one gets an illness over someone saying a nickname on the goddamn internet. Bruh, have you seen- I already made a video on this person half a year ago, if not above a half a year ago. How stupid are you? Have you done your research? Legit, imagine comparing a Shorts channel, which what did you expect? Shorts channels are god awful, to a normal channel when people expect effort into it. Just to defend someone shooting fireworks in his own room twice. And plus showing his private parts. This guy did one big mistake, so shut. <laughs> what do you mean one big mistake? He made multiple big mistakes. Legit, if you want to see the comments of me just insulting these people, go into this video, go in the comment sections, and you'll probably find me in replies insulting the ever-loving hell out of these people. Anyone's gonna fail the video there? I recommend to show this to any desperate I show speed fan and get the, all of their hopes completely crushed and devastated and made them realize they're defending the wrong goddamn channel all along. Or they're just gonna be even more dumb and stupid. Anyways, I'm fading out the video now. Thanks for watching.